ZF Windpower's Shift 7K has picked up the drivetrain gold because, simply, it's broken the 200 Newton meters per kilogram torque density barrier at platform level and can go even higher for dedicated designs. It is further a fully modular four-stage concept and the more than 200 Newton meters per kilogram barrier is achieved while only deploying journal bearings in the first planetary stage to reduce size and associated components. It's only two years since the Shift 6K set the previous record at 175 Newton meters per kilogram, so that's a vast improvement in only a brief period. And the experts at ZF are confident that the over 200 Newton meters per kilogram is definitely not the maximum achievable torque density level. A key element and main enabler is in-depth understanding of how an entire system works and whereby even load sharing between all planetary gear planets is a crucial design aspect. The Shift 7K four-stage version has three multiple planet planetary stages and only journal bearings in the first stage. Four-stage gearboxes have more components than their three-stage equivalents, but most parts are smaller in size and to meet global standards, the maximum nacelle width is limited to 4.2 meters, meaning a maximum about 2.1 meter ring gear outer diameter for the first stage. Taking inspiration from the automotive industry, the shift platform is fully modular and as a result is straightforward to scale. This gives the gearbox developers maximum design flexibility and allows faster development of new products particularly as all shift platforms from Shift 3K to Shift 7K are made of standardized building blocks. This is a gearbox pushing the boundaries of torque density and input torque focused at especially next generation onshore wind turbines with a parallel focus at pursuing modularity and innovation for driving down the levelized cost of energy.